what is up guys lazy boy here and today i have another video for you guys in today's video we are going to be installing spybot search and destroy this video is just on how to install it so if you know how to if you already have the program go check out my video on how to use spybot but this video is specifically how to install it so what you want to do is you can either go and search for spybot or it'll be in the description down below if you want to search just click or type in uh, spybot search it should be the first one spybot search and destroy click enter and then uh, right here is what you're looking for is safer networking make sure it's safer networking to stay safe just remember that don't do file hippo or I think there's a CNET yeah CNET Tom's guide don't you don't need that download it directly from safer networking those are the people who uh, created the program so just click on it right here first should be the first one make sure it's safer networking and then we're gonna scroll down to uh, spybot free should be right here click on it scroll down a little more go to spybot free edition click on that and then basically avoid these main mirrors they're basically if you click on them I think they pull up like an ad it's faster download or whatever but you have to go through like an ad or something like that just go to the ad free download at safer networking LTD and click on number one two or three pick whichever one you want click download it'll bring you to another page on this page what you want to do is uh, click download again right here in the middle and if you feel if you feel like the after you get the program and you use it you like it feel free to donate helps the people uh, who created the program stay free so click download it'll begin downloading as I was saying feel free to donate it like that's how these programs are free they work off of donations and without donations and things like that they, they can't uh, keep the programs free because somebody's got to do it and that takes time and time is money so in the bottom left your program should be here if it is click on it and it'll open if not uh, I will show you right now how to do it, <clears throat> how to get to it. So I'll just close this down. Remember, if it did pop up in the bottom left, just click on it and wait for a second. If it didn't pop up, go to the bottom right. If you're on Windows 10, I'm pretty sure it's the same on Windows 7 and 8. Right click and then go to File Explorer. It'll open that up. Go to Downloads right here. Double click and top right. It's easier just to search for a spy search and you'll have your executable file so there should be one file I just downloaded it twice by accident just double click on it and it'll bring you to the run page we previously saw so <clears throat> once on the run page just click run it'll ask you if you want to allow this app to make uh, changes on your device click yes because we do want that to happen if uh, you speak a different language which I assume you speak English uh, if you're watching this video but if English is like your second language feel free to uh, select your main language um, your first language and if you're speaking English just click OK uh, click next Spybot is really good with not putting other programs in their files so like usually if you get a free program like this it will install a thousand other things because you just keep clicking next 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 and unchecking them but Spybot's not like that is a great 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 people great people great program uh, just click this first um, this first option here uh, install spybot for personal use and we'll decide later click next I want to be protected without having to attend to my attend to it myself this is basically uh, if you know what you're doing which you probably don't because you're watching the video on how to um, install it but if you if you're if you had experience with spybot before I guess you can go with uh, more control which is basically you'll set up your settings and like that things like that but just go with the I want to be protected without having to attend it to it myself this is the easiest selection this is kinda like I guess the beginner selection whatever you want to call it um, read through this if you want to terms and agreements uh, it's the typical blah 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 um, next I don't know what's in it because I've never read it you know and then uh, here it's just telling you where it's installing some information on uh, what's installing. Um, again, that feature earlier that we saw with um, the more control, this is more advanced setting. Like 
uh, you would choose which one which of these you want to install if you chose that more advanced setting so just go remember to go with the uh, the simple setting uh, then just click install and it'll install it's pretty fast what really takes a long time is the update that we're about to see here as you can see it dropped a um, desktop icon on my computer and so if you hit finish right here it will uh, automatically boot up and start updating which is okay um, do you need help no you don't need help you're watching the, uh, this video so or I have another video on it it's easier to watch the video than go through these dialogues just uh, the link will be down in the description below on how to use spybot um, but here's the program it's pretty much this page right here and now you have spybot so if you need help on how to use it or if you know already know how to use it don't worry about this you can click away from the video now but if you need help on how to use spybot which it's very simple um, the link will be down in the description below I'll see if I can put it on the screen now we'll see how that goes but it will be down uh, in the description below if not go to my YouTube channel find the and just find the video it should be pretty self-explanatory but uh, make sure you go watch that video because there is a couple things you need to do before you run your first scan and we want to make sure we get all those viruses off so thank you guys for watching that's how you install spybot search and destroy again if you want to see how to use it click on that video in the description box down below and uh, remember to like this video if you like it dislike it if you dislike it and remember to comment leave some feedback on how I can improve my videos maybe I need to slow down talking maybe I need to speed up things like that and then don't forget to hit that subscribe button thanks for watching guys lazy boy out